Hi everyone. Uh, thank you Caritas Roma for having invited me to share our experiences in this island nation in facing COVID-19, the global pandemic. For the last few months, global extraordinary unraveling is occurring without leaving anyone untouched. The social and economic disruptions of this crisis will be deep, broad and long lasting. The pandemic COVID-19 has already enveloped and destabilized the world. There is no shortage of bad news. It is impacting our ability to be productive and engaged in our work. Here in Sri Lanka, as a nation of unity and humanity, together we are taking major precautions to protect our physical health. Confronting the challenges posited by the pandemic, the government of Sri Lanka had to strategically manipulate the situation throughout the country. Virtually everything has come to a halt. No public gatherings, no public religious observances, no schools, no work for almost two and a half months. This situation is indeed making a huge dent in the country's economy. Putting the protection of people and the safeguarding of the communities first against the pandemic, not the economy, is a bold, commendable step taken by our new president. This initiative has inspired the whole of Sri Lanka to come up with a strong humanitarian response in caring for the weak, the poorest of the poor, regardless of caste, creed and religion. Against this backdrop, there is a silent uprising of spiritual renewal and a sense of collective responsibility, which I would believe is the initial impetus to rise up from the debris of pandemic devastation. We know that the social and the economic fabric have been greatly affected, but the undying spirit of humanity is prevailing throughout the country. Therefore, it looks like this pandemic is a blessing in disguise. This has left people with enough holidays to relax their mind and to sleep on the primordial principle of the meaning and the purpose of life in front of the shattering citadels of materialism, of which we were at the peak before the pandemic. Though the island nation has come to a halt against the pandemic, the collective mind of the people is slowly but steadily headlong towards unearthing the secrets of ancient agricultural technologies and ancient heritages of wisdom and knowledge to stand up on their own feet as a self-sufficient nation soon. Thanks to the pandemic that inspires the people to awaken their sleeping giant, it is in this chaos and crisis of pandemic the whole nation is tested for its character. Multiple inventions are made, innovative thinking blended with creativity, heroes are born, scientists and researchers are in the making. The intelligentsia is in operation. I'm sure the pandemic surprise package to the whole world would surely come from this beautiful island nation. Hope and pray. This pandemic would soon be vanished from the surface of this beautiful earth. May the people all around come to a full swing to beautify the world again with a beautiful smile. God bless you all.